Welcome. So in this video, we are going to try to install Firefox. So let's try to search Firefox or or more like we we will try to install an software from the internet from the website, not through the App Store. So I search Firefox. I'm going to go download Firefox and I have a disk image now that's what i wanted to show you now you can see this actually kind of jumped so basically it's saying hey i have that file i'm gonna go here and let's see what we have there so if i go there and click on that you can see opening firefox dmg and it's saying verifying so basically dot dmg is a disk image and you can see uh, what I have over here right here is basically it looks like a drive and it's been mounted so just like on Windows you mount a drive disk images you can mount by it clicking on them double clicking that's what happened now what Firefox wants me to do is drag it and move it over here so if I do it notice that plus sign if again notice that plus sign if I move it to the uh, desktop notice this plus sign so that's what it wants me to do as uh, notice that uh, symbol uh, that is like do not do this symbol that's what so if I move it to App Store oops and here I'm gonna drop it you can see that the progress bar it's over here and oh it popped us here as well it's being installed it went from gray to colorful if I click on it double click it's jumping here I have the yeah open and I have Firefox let's try YouTube I have a working app and that's how you install uh, from the um, websites now let's close it close this as well and get rid of that we still have this now ideally uh, what happens is that uh, if you go inside nothing is in there but the I saw early an option where it will automatically on uh, down uh, delete everything uh, it was a nice feature of Mac I can't remember which one it was but you can uh, for the sake of this video let's first eject it just like in Windows you eject it it's gone from your hard drive then go to finder your downloads and I believe it's gone no Firefox right there so you can get rid of it for example you can simply move to trash delete it so now it's no longer uh, hoarding any space on your drive <laughs> the other feature that I saw I can <laughs> was that as soon as I installed Google Chrome uh, it actually prompted me to delete the installation file the media and I, I it was a pleasant surprise so uh, uh, the other way is always going yourself and removing the disk images so you are not uh, utilizing this space just to store what you really don't need all right so let's wrap this video here i hope this video has helped you if it has please rate comment subscribe and share and i see you in the next one